Like? Can I get a personal pan cheese pizza? Mm -hmm. And then an order of cheesy breadsticks with extra cheese. And with sauce? Can I do marinara sauce and the garlic butter? Anything else? That's all. Total of 22 25 Thank you. What's good guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, hi, I'm Sakila. This is my first ever mukbang. Um, but just take off my lid for up now. Um, but yeah, so we're going to talk a little bit about social media and its toxicity. If that's a word, let's Google it. I don't know if it's a word. Let me make sure that I'm saying things right. Toxicity. Toxicity. Yep. So I've seen a lot of social media has become something that people I don't that doesn't make okay let me say it like this social media is good and it's bad it has its ups and its downs pros and cons as do any other thing right um I feel in the sense that we use social media for more of a negative than a positive I think people have become so engrossed in social media and portraying a life on social media that they forget to live in reality in a sense a lot of people do things for social media you know and they don't even get paid to do it like you know how there are social media influencers who their job is to post on social media people people go places they do things they work close they this that and the other for social media so that they can post on social media so people can see it right now i don't necessarily think there's anything necessarily wrong with doing that but when it becomes your life when it becomes i have to look good for social media like i can't get on the snap if i don't have on makeup or i can't get on the snap if my hair wasn't done i can't get on the snap if it's done in your life when social media becomes so important to you that it just starts your image of yourself really i had gotten to a point at one time where I would not want to get on Snapchat if my brows weren't done or if I didn't personally feel like I looked presentable. It's like, bro, you don't look like this 24 7. So, why are you trying to portray it to you? No? Huh? I seen this tweet where, uh, why do people eat and talk? I seen this tweet. This is based around Bermudians though, but um, we just got, we have this parade in Bermuda, Bermuda Day Parade, which will showcase our heritage and stuff, culture, not anymore because Bermuda's culture is, is gone, but um, so this girl was on Twitter and she was saying how it's kind of sad, how the younger lot would rather dress up and look cute than participate in the parade. Like I remember telling my boyfriend, like I was a major rep when I was in the parade, like I mean, I was younger. But like nowadays, everybody just wants to be able to get a pic for Instagram or Snap or... Social media really has just taken over lives. Like, people don't even want to just, like, enjoy life, you know? I feel like everything's become fake and stage and nobody's really real anymore, you know? Like, I'm sweating. I'm gonna turn the fan on. People have just become so engulfed in what other people are doing. Even in that aspect, like, everyone is so concerned about what other people are doing. Other people's life. Like, that's what social media has turned into. Look how big this piece is. <laughs> that's what social media has turned into. A reality TV show. Uh. Everything is done for likes and retweets. See, like just anything that involves multitasking, I just cannot do. I'm like eating and the food's so good. I'm not even thinking about. I just think everything's become so fake and everyone's become so obsessed with becoming a social media influencer. I guess where everybody wants to make it a job. To post pictures on Instagram, make YouTube videos, and travel. Right? It's like, bro, 
Do you have any other ghosts? Do you have any other ghosts? Now you're probably thinking, Sika, but Sika, you're trying to be successful on YouTube. You're right, but I'm not trying to. This ain't gonna be my only means of living. Like you know what I'm saying? I have, I have goals, I have plans, I have things that I wish to do with my degree that I'm going to get. You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to just. I don't want to just be someone who posts on social media or something like that. And just like it seems like social media influencer is the end all be all of every career. Social media has made us um, think that any other career is not it's not a good career. Or if you're not moved out by 21, what are you doing with your life? If you ain't got your own apartment and you're in, by 21, you're in house, by 25, what are you doing? You ain't got a boyfriend or a girlfriend yet. What are you doing with your life? You know what I'm saying? Social media has just made everything so like distorted. It has just distorted everyone's idea of reality. There must be without a real life miserable. I remember. I don't know if you guys heard about the visa babe. The girl who didn't have enough money for her visa, but she was traveling and doing this general derp. Social media is a lie. Social media is a lie. People put out there what they want you to see. You're looking up to you, trying to be like you want to live the same lifestyle as this person and that person. But like, their life isn't even all that great. Everybody has issues. Everybody's life is not, nobody's life is perfect. Might portray it like that. But looks can be deceiving. It hurts my heart, man. When I see people like, oh, I wanna be like this person. And that person, um, be yourself. If there's anyone you, man, there's anyone you. I'm just seeing social media change people for the worse. I'm seeing it change people for the better, but I'm seeing it change people for the worse. People become fake and bougie and stuck up because they got numbers behind their name, like the seven followers pay your bills. Seven followers give you joy, the seven followers give you peace. The seven like you know what I'm saying? There are so many other things that are more important oh, excuse me to life than having followers. Social media just really has distorted people's vision. Distorted your mindset. You know, the way in which you think life should be lived. Just distorted it all. Like, even sometimes I feel myself, I'm like, thanks, you ain't doing nothing. You're 22, and this is all these 21 year olds around you. And their apartments, and this and that, and making all this money, and this and that. And when I remember when I was 22, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't like this. Like, and it's like, okay, that was a different time. But even still, in terms of just the 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 pressure, there's a different type of pressure to have it all together because of what social media says you're supposed to have done by this time. And it's like, no, be everybody is different. Everybody's path is different. Everybody's journey is different. Everybody grows at a different pace, like. So just because I'm 22 and just getting to university doesn't make me. I just took this one. Doesn't make me any less than somebody who's 22 and just graduated from university. Or 22 and got there in an apartment. Like, I don't even think I'm ready to be paying no bills at 22 years old. I'm not ready to be having to pay around electricity, water, food, gas. For my car, burn bill, right? Like, just say hi, then. Hey, man. Okay. What up, YouTube? Let's get us red check because we're late again. It's basically a Christmas case, and she dissed me. <coughs> yeah. It's Don't not. Edit it's I not. Well, no, I want the world to red check. It's not good weather today. Followers of YouTube, she red check me. She dissed me. Go here, and I'll get red check. Hang up. Let me hang up on you. Okay.
Anyway, hey guys. But yeah, I lost my train of thought now. Uh, I just think that people shouldn't allow social media to dictate their life. You know? Live life, enjoy it. Why you gotta snap every single moment of your life, you know? Actually live life. Make head memories and not Snapchat memories. Um, <laughs> I just be like, just enjoy it. Everything doesn't have to be recorded. You could actually just enjoy it. Live in the moment. You have to take a picture of every single thing that happens in your life. Live in the moment, you know? But yeah, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up if you agree with what I said or disagree. Let me know in the comment section. Um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because you know you want to be lit with me. Follow me on Instagram and on Snapchat. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.